Ah, yes. So when we talk about uh, uh, feeling good on our feet, and we're talking about when we when we go from something that uh, is really makes your your home or your business look blah to something very very exciting, it's something really cool, it's something long lasting, and installed by uh, people you can trust. I think of Surfaces USA. I don't know what you think of, but I think of Surfaces USA. What do you think of, Jen, from Surfaces you know, USA? <laughs> I go right to Surfaces USA. Of course. But uh, really, and, and of course, in past interviews, we've discussed uh, uh, the type of level of service and things like that. And, and the fact that you yourself are an interior designer by trade, which makes right. a huge difference in really not just selling something your your latest whatever is is overloaded in your warehouse but really dialing into the mindset of of uh the the homeowner or business owner what they want and really understanding maybe that hot pink won't look as good as you think it does based on based on what i know about you you right or maybe hot pink would be wonderful you know right but either way uh, i want to talk a little bit what what speaking of hot what is hot right now as far as uh styles or you know we're kind of running the gamut of things right now so flooring wise the wood porcelain planks are amazing. They are not a trend. They are not going out of style. We are actually ripping out real wood or laminate floors and putting in the wood porcelain planks. Um, I would say that's just one of the biggest things right now. They're so realistic looking. And when they're installed properly, you can't get a better look. I mean, it's just gorgeous. You know, wood flooring is something that is always like wood flooring. You know, real estate agents always says that, you know, even if it's laminate or whatever, but still right. that's something that really is appealing to many, many people. Tell me what the difference is when we talk about porcelain. Are we talking about something that's like, that's it, we're done? Pretty much. I mean, you still will have a very minimal grout line. And what we try and do is, you know, select a grout that kind of fades in so you don't really see it. But these wood planks are now being made with high def printers. So you get the knotting, you get the grain, They'll put in a texture, but you get the look of the real wood. You get the upkeep of a porcelain floor. So no staining, no gouging, no denting, no worries if water spills on it. You're not going to get buckling and have to redo all your floors. So you get the look of the real hardwoods, but you get the durability of a porcelain tile. I was talking uh, in a past interview uh, with you about my prowess with home improvement (laughs) projects. And I did have a a house that had uh, the laminate flooring. And thought I had turned off. I was I was replacing uh, a faucet in the kitchen. Oh, no. Thought I had turned off the water, and, and in fact I did not. And yeah, I had a little a little. Fortunately, not as bad as like real wood floors. But even still, it was it was something that was able to be seen. For, that my right. wife reminded me of every time. So something like this for someone like me sounds like the the way to go because if it doesn't buckle, and also pets too and things like I was, that. That's I mean, what I was just going to touch on. Yeah, the pets. So we just recently bought a puppy, and she's at the shop all the time. But she is a very big, dense puppy. Um, So we do have wood in our house right now, um, and I see her nail marks. She also likes to swim in her water bowl. So if I don't clean it up right away, I get all of the... I've noticed a couple areas where her water bowl is, there's a little bit of buckling, even if I put a mat or something down below it. So just my lifestyle is more conducive to having tile. I have a four-year-old, I have a dog, and we live actively in our home. So uh, we've got got wood porcelain uh, flooring. What else is is hot right now? You know, countertops, I've kind of started to notice that we're swaying more towards an equal balance of granite and quartz. It used to be, I would say, the vast majority of people were still doing granite countertops. It's pretty equal now on people installing granite and people installing quartz. People want the solid surface. They want the look of marble. They want something more contemporary. They're going with the quartz versus the busyness or the, the variations that you get in granite. So I'm doing a little bit of both. And it's fun to see how equally split it is all of a sudden. But we- and that's, that's pretty fascinating. Uh, things that when people are taking notice of, it sounds like to me, like things that are going to, to transcend. Exactly. You know, what we, when we talk about um, timely fashions that can go out. It really is. And so one of the things I encourage my customers to do is if you want a wow factor in your kitchen, you don't have to have the wow factor on your countertop and your backsplash. Make your backsplash your accent piece. It's easy enough. It's cost effective enough that if in three years things do change or five years your tastes change and the average person does redecorate every five to seven years if they stay in the same home. So if in five years you don't like what you put in your house, your backsplash is easy enough to pull off and redo without changing the bones of the kitchen, without... affecting your countertop. So that's something that I encourage people to have a little bit more 
of a pop in their backsplash and have it be a little bit more exciting because that is something you can change and adapt over time. Exactly. There are, there are some homes in Santa Clarita, of course, that have been built as, as early as the 50s, but a lot of them are. The ones that are in the central neighborhoods that are really popular are still some built in the 60s. And believe it or not, there are some homes that have not been They've remodeled. not been touched. So if they have a, if, if a home you, you purchased, you're thinking, okay, I'm going to go ahead and redo this myself, but it has like the avocado kitchen or the high-low uh, pile in the bathroom or uh, you know any any other the, the mauve right. what was that wasn't that like in the 80s that we're kind seeing of a lot of that pink kind of in stuff. the blue mm -hmm. uh, things like that that you want to change services USA is we, the place to go you have a showroom on the old road I do I have an amazing showroom uh, 30629 the old road in Castaic just north of Hasley Canyon very easy to find it'd be, it'd be there's only one side of the street you gotta look on from there it easy. is and you can't pass the big slabs of granite sitting in the yard. So. Exactly. And also you can uh, contact, there's a couple ways. First of all, you can uh, check out the website, servicesusa.com slash contact, which does have some samples. Now you want to go into the showroom to see everything up close and personal and talk to Jen, but you can also call 775-9404 with your questions. Always a pleasure to talk, Good to, see you. to talk surfaces with you, Jen. So uh, continued success and uh, have a great day. You too. Thank you. You bet.